Yeah, I'm angry. I'm really angry. Even though we've got, there's some great sentiment about why the law is changing, where you talk about the Affordable Care Act, or you talk about the CCOs here in Klamath County or Oregon at large, and the governor's uh, initiative to get these things rolling, we're still wasting money. We aren't addressing the real issues. We're putting a Band-Aid over it again. We're going to try to limit costs by really denying services. The need is so great here that it's just not being taken care of. People are saying it's taken care of, but it's just not. They need to be able to see what he goes through, what kids go through. <clears throat> They're basically saying that he can live in pain. He has other hernias that we haven't even taken him to the doctor for yet because we're afraid they'll get denied too. And how does that make you feel? Like <laughs> dirt. The person has to be dying practically before they will approve a surgery. It's ridiculous that I had to leave the state for this. I, I had a life here. I would not have moved if I would have got proper medical care here. There's too many families, too many lives that are getting hurt over all this. You see here, uh, in the box here, we have uh, over 12,000. We have another uh, 2,000 and something that the teams reported out as of this morning, as of last night. So this, by tonight, we're, we'll be at 15,000. We need to get half the citizens of Klamath County to oppose Cascades Comprehensive Care as being a CCO. Um, we will, and we can. They have to realize this is kind of tragic. I mean, they're this big company. If they had been doing their job all along, this would, none of this would be happening.